Good morning and thanks for joining us. I'm Mary Nelson. And I'm Mike DiGiacomo. It is Fat Tuesday. Yes, this is your favorite holiday. I didn't know this about you. <laughs> Why would you say that? You like this holiday, right? <laughs> I well, like back in your younger and days. And king cake. Yeah, well, yeah, the key cake. Vignettes. Yes. Maybe some po' boys, right? Oh, well, good. revelers are waking up to cold temperatures and light rain in New Orleans. This is a live look at the city right there. A little calm right now, mm -hmm. huh? But things should be dry for the first parade when it starts. They'll all wind down later this afternoon, though. Those outdoor celebrations will continue until midnight. Yeah, when it's, uh, it looks windy down there. It looks it looks a little nasty. Look, I love seeing the folks walking around and all their brightly colored stuff, ready to have fun, yeah, make friends. Yeah, good times. I've yeah. never been down there for Mardi Gras. I'd yeah. love to go down there. Never. Done yeah, I had family that lived there, and boy, they loved mm -hmm. it. Yeah, big they celebration. Did. At KMTV, we're proud to partner with the Omaha Children's Museum on the Once Upon a Farm exhibit. Today, we're glad to give you the chance to take a tour of the exhibit along with us. Kayla Thomas, we've dispatched her live to show us one of the most popular areas. Kayla, what's up? You guys, it is an exciting Tuesday morning here. It's member day, so they open an hour early for, Zoom, or for Omaha Children's Museum members. So we'll have some kids probably trailing up here in a couple minutes. Of course, as part of a sponsor of the exhibit, KMTV's section is all about the weather and some fun weather facts here that you may not know. Did you know that KMTV got its name from Earl May, the seed and nursery store? The M and KMTV actually stands for May. Also down at the very bottom of the list, we love Ryan McPike. He's one of our buddies here. We see him at the studio all the time. He became a weather nut at age five when he got out of school for two days because of a big snowstorm. So there's your weather facts. <laughs> I'm gonna show that. you guys, this is so cool. As you know, in the studio, the chroma key wall is one of the favorite areas for all the kids, adults, everybody else. I gotta get down because I'm a little bit taller than most of the kids. So they have a kid sized chroma key here. So look, you can pretend. Don't you wish that it was 72 degrees and freezing today? <laughs> Obviously, this forecast for a little bit more spring light weather. Here we go. So kids have the opportunity to pretend to do the weather themselves, and they can also learn about the role that weather plays in farming. Once Upon a Farm is open here through April 12th. So if you haven't come down to see it yet, less than two months to do it. If you have come down, a little motivation to come back because they got something new hatching over in the other area. I'll show you that in about 15 minutes or so. I wonder if you can guess what it might be. I don't know. I already know the answer. Uh, you do? Yeah. Well, hey, back to that weather wall. My son Grayson did it. He did his, he did his best Ryan oh. McPike impersonation down Love there. It. Love that's it. A fu that's a fun exhibit. Absolutely. And I bet he was just as smooth as Ryan, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if he'll be that smooth. Uh, Thanks, Kayla. Thanks, Kayla. Lady Gaga is no longer caught in a bad romance. She's engaged to actor Taylor Kinney. Yeah, the pop star shared the news yesterday. She posted a photo of a ring on her finger and wrote, he gave me his heart on Valentine's Day, and I said yes. Yeah, well, the, she met the guy on the, the set of the You and I video, which was shot in Sarpy County, mm -hmm. you remember. Now, this is kind of all sad to me. I mean, this is, this is the video right here. But yeah. you remember our old buddy Luke Carl from Sarpy County. He used to date... Yes. Lady Gaga, we had him on the show. Mm -hmm. Well, Luke, it is better to have loved and lost than to have never loved. Uh, Luke, a broken heart is just the growing pains necessary so that you can love more completely when the real thing comes along. Just wanted to give you some advice, Luke, if you're hurting out there. Good to see you. Call me if you need anything. Okay. Does anybody, Thanks, Luke. He could be supportive and thrilled for her. He might be. He, actually, they're good what friends. Is, I feel like I'm living <laughs> in a parallel universe. <laughs> Well, you know, I just, Luke and I, we bought it. I just want to make sure he's okay. You're Actually, hilarious. Luke's mom watches this show, right? Yeah, he, it's great. C call us if, we, if Luke needs to talk, okay? <laughs> anyway, okay. an Omaha grandma named Deborah Harris is going to be on Let's Make a Deal today. Uh, Action 3 News reporter Lindsay Thies will be watching the show with Deborah and her family. Yeah, and you can get their live reaction on Upfront at 4. We can't tell you if she won, but we can tell you she was selected to get up on stage with Wayne Brady to make a deal. So we can't wait to see that today. See how it turned out. That's hey, right. Country Music Hall of Famer Merle Haggard is bringing his dozens of number one hits to the Ralston Arena on February 26th. Yeah, you want to go? We want to send you. Head to our website, omahamorningblend.com. Click on contest to register. We're going to give away a pair of tickets each day this week at 2 o'clock. Winners will be selected at random. Just look for official rules there. The bubble, it's online. Okay, so you ready? We're gonna get you dreaming. We're gonna get you dreaming mm. about a Western Mediterranean mm. getaway, including the countries you can visit 
and learn about making that trip more affordable in Travel Tuesday. First, let's swing by the Nissan of Omaha Green Room and see who's hanging out today. So in addition to our leisure travel specialist, Ty Gals, we've got a couple of musicians in the house. Matt Whipke's absent. There's Corey tuning his guitar. Look forward to hearing that new song. Go ahead.